Yo, hey, hey. So in this video today, I want to showcase the most efficient system that exists in our galaxy, our trade-based society that humans came up with. Look at all these boats. They are completely empty. All right, so what I want to highlight a little bit in this video is the stupidity of our human species. I mean, in the last video, I showcased already that so many apartments in this city here are not being used at all or used for only three months of the year and empty for nine months of the year because in those three months, there's the tourist season here. And yeah, it's just a huge waste that our trade-based society creates. And the same goes now for boats. I mean, I'm just standing right next to some really luxurious, expensive boats. And as you can see, they are just empty and just standing around, not being used at all. And yeah, just a waste in the end. So I'm also sure that there are many people who are willing to learn and who would love to go with the boat on the sea to enjoy going snorkeling or enjoying the sun and just sailing itself. But they are not able to do so because they don't have enough money, you know. In order to access one of these boats, you need to trade something. You need to trade your currency. And many people don't have enough. They don't have the possibility to access one of these boats because they don't have enough money but on the other hand we have an abundance as you can see these boats are there they are physical standing around here but many people can't use them and the same goes with cars the same goes with these apartments that i showcased in the last video the same applies for many many things and this doesn't make sense at all because we are creating an abundance of stuff yet we limit people to access it because for what to make a profit All these boats that are standing around here not being used, all the cars that are not being used, all the waste that we create is also strongly connected to the notion of property that human beings develop, kind of. Because, you know, in order to access something like a boat like this, you need to buy it. So then it is yours. But who's saying that? Like, that says the seller, that says the police, that says our society, basically. There's no cosmic law that proves that this boat is actually yours or this cloth is actually mine. And how would it be if we just, instead of owning these things, just share these things? Whenever you like want to access one of these boats, you can access one. And then when you don't need it anymore, you can share it with other people. I mean, this is a much more efficient way, right? Because then whenever you don't need it or you don't use it then other people have access to it and can use this thing but if you look all around the world this notion of property is very persistent because people yeah they claim to own a piece of land they claim to own a house they claim to own a boat a, a car whatever it is but what happens if you throw something away i mean what happens to all the electronics that we use day by day but then eventually we throw them away and there's this interesting documentary called Welcome to Sodom. And there you can clearly see that like the super poor people need to then deal with that. They try to yeah, recycle these things but live under super poor conditions. It is really completely fucked up. So what would happen if we, instead of owning things, just access them? Like, if I want to use a boat, I can just pick one of those, I can use them, have a great day on the sea, enjoy my life, and then have the motivation and curiosity to learn more about the world and help other people, instead of, yeah, just 
having to slave away in a job in order to buy one of these boats and then it is not being used like most of the year as you can see with all of these boats. And it's really interesting because right now I can kind of see from the top to this city and I know how many apartments there are empty. I know how many boats there are like standing around all year not being used at all or only very little. And that really pisses me off and that should piss you off as well. So let's fucking do something about this. Let's educate the world and provide trade free services for everyone so that we can all have a good life on this planet, that we can all learn about this planet and understand better our relation with this planet and our role in the universe. Okay, that was it from here, from Aaron, from the elephant in the room. See you in the next video and as always, take care and much love. So I was just editing the video and I thought I can add some more footage from the Lake of Constance because I was cycling around the Lake of Constance recently for like 9 days and guess what I saw? I saw a lot of empty boats standing around not being used. So yeah, it's, it's more than ridiculous, it's so retarded. Our society is so fucked up but most people just don't get it or they just don't say anything but yeah what can i do i can just make people aware of that so now have fun and see some more boats around the lake of constance not being used standing around <laughs>